Alrighty, what is going on everybody? You already know who it is. It is your boy, the Dryer Nude here. And today we're doing another underrated aimer series. And this is the first controller player we have on the channel for the underrated aim series. This guy is highly underrated. Some dude, my boy Rocket, okay? Guys, if you don't know who this is, be sure to subscribe to his YouTube channel right here. Let's see if we can get him up to a hundred subscribers. So if you guys could just absolutely go crazy for me, first off. Also, comment down in the comment section below if you want to hear some controller tips and tricks from this guy. He is absolutely nuts. We're going to go over it. And basically, all you guys who say that you can't have good movement without like a scuff or something, this guy doesn't play claw and he doesn't have a scuff right now. His scuff is actually broken. He's getting it back soon. But all this movement you're seeing is on a default controller. And don't mind the title right here. He doesn't use a Cronus Max, okay? It looks like he does, but he doesn't. Trust me, this guy's name is absolutely nuts and his decision-making and playing is absolutely disgusting. So let's get right into it. A nice kill coming in, flying in, playing some Rebirth. We love Rebirth, but let's look at this aim, man. Just look at it. He's using the M4 and you guys don't know how incredibly difficult this is to do, even on controller. You have to have decent aim, decent mouth control, literally not missing a bullet. And this is just absolutely nuts. One of the best aim I have ever seen on controller. This guy's highly underrated. So like I said, if you guys could do me a favor, go subscribe to his channel. Description or the link will be in the top of the description below. But just look, playing super, super smart and basically his positioning his movement is absolutely nuts man on a different level sees this guy coming in beams him out of the sky with the m4 and using the ak-74 you really really good gun but look at this he just pushes people just pushes people and heard that guy fly in he jumps downstairs there's a nade he slides in gets this kill does some movement and literally destroys this guy if you guys are going up against him you're, you're probably going to lose it makes everything look so easy but you have no clue how hard it is to do this like different level man on a different level uh let's see beaming this guy out of the sky missing a couple of bullets but look at that tracking really good and a lot of people who say well he has aim assist this guy's this guy he practices without aim assist okay he could do well without aim assist. He doesn't need aim assist, but pretty much he's just a really good player. Look at this movement, just really good decision-making, really good placement. And this is what you need when you are trying to play and get better at the game. Study people like this. He has multiple clips on his channel. And like I said, let me know down in the comment section below if you want him to do a tips and tricks video on pretty much how to play Warzone and how to get better for all the controller players out there. Because personally, I think he is on a different level than me and he's a really good guy to you know teach or for you to learn from and he could teach you and break it down for you. Now he drops down here, gets this kill boom throwing knife also you notice he's not using the heartbeat and uh he's using the throwing knife and he's using um stuns this guy doesn't use heartbeat at all just because you don't need it stuns uh situational awareness map awareness there's a uav marks him backs off the gunfight and this is what i've been talking about in my latest video where you do not have to challenge every gunfight you see boom hits him but he goes down See, his back was exposed, he got greedy. But back up here, look at this. The M4 just challenges this guy, literally destroys him, and on a different level, man. Look at this, boom. Oh my gosh. That guy didn't know what was happening, man. It's just so satisfying to watch this. Look at that bunny hopping. But again, he's doing all this without a scuff. Just a regular default PS4 controller. He doesn't have a Cronus Max or anything like that. Just pure skill. Gets the high ground. Jumps down. Sees this guy to the left. He knows this guy to the right. Jumps over. Gets him. Easy. Literally not wasting ammo. Turns around on that guy. Just insane stuff, man. Insane stuff. Drops down. And you notice he pushes everything, man. But he smart pushes about it. Like... His positioning and everything is really, really good. His tracking is really good. 
missed the throwing knife there but the reason why he uses a throwing knife is pretty much because you do not want to waste ammo on been getting the finish kill he literally uses it to get the uh, down or the kill confirm the kill real quick and then able to have enough ammo for the second fight boom look at that slide man just so satisfying to watch the aiming is really good positioning slides in kills this guy bro on another level look at this gets him and you notice a lot of people don't notice this but when you're playing rebirth and you kill the enemy uh you'll notice a little ping on the map when you kill somebody and it tells you where all the uh enemies are or his like the enemy's teammates are it is really useful look at that just playing smart he sees that guy to the right going around slide cancels he's outside slides in gets the kill knows his teammates up top look at this man just beautiful beautiful stuff look at the movement jumps around this guy literally could not track him now if you guys are wondering his sensitivity he plays on um 66.85 ads sensitivity uh dynamic uh tactical sprint and pretty much yeah that's what he does and he plays flipped also so uh l1 l2 is what is to ads and then r1 or r l1 and l l1 and r1 is what they use to l l1 is going to be the ads wow and r1 is going to be uh shoot and l2 and l3 are your tacticals and stuns well, I don't know why I had such a difficult time saying that, man. But like, literally, he has a ton of clips like this on his channel, just literally going off on kids. And he wins. He has so many wins in Rebirth, man. Just a super underrated player. And he plays like this in Warzone, too. So if you guys want to go check him out, like I said, his channel is going to be in the top of the description. Slides in, kills this guy. And then immediately, he's going to slide through and just beam this kid down him down the next kid waiting beams him off the heady i don't even know why that kid challenged being that kid man m4 are it's just nuts bro just nuts look at this positioning see he's using the heady that is what i'm talking about man just positioning well and he got greedy there he should have stayed on the heady and he would have had that kill look at this just beaming kids man always having the positioning this guy was running towards him he kills him real quick look he's using the heady slides around slides through want to stay on the heady doesn't peek out too far patience just waiting on that kid to push out also you notice there's a lot of rose skins that he's killing so these guys are still pretty good man like you're a try hard if you use a rose skin for sure i mean i use a rose skin so that is the video guys i hope you enjoyed it like i said be sure to go down let's see if we can get them up to 100 subscribers guys if you enjoyed this video be sure to smack a like on it and let me know if you want to see more of rocket and some more videos like this underrated aimers always remember to stay blessed and stay humble and i'll catch you in a future video peace